The scripture says that, um, I forgot what exactly, the scripture says, uh, stay ye still and see the salvation of the, of the Lord, man. That's what he said, that stand still and see the salvation, see what I'm going to do. And that's why the Lord said, what, in this day and age, Israel's never not going to be able to say that they're the one that got himself out of Egypt. And it's going to be even talked about even more than Egypt, man. But what our people, as soon as they came out of Egypt, they don't they forgot what the Lord did. That's why the Lord not bringing everybody out of this Egypt. He's only bringing out the ones that's going to actually praise His name when He when He does do it, man. Which is the hopeful alike, the house of David. Go ahead. And I sent before thee Moses, Aaron, and Miriam. O oh, my people, remember now what Balak, king of Moab, consulted, and what. Ba ba Balaam, the son of B, or answered him from Shittim. Son of Oh, uh, Balaam, the son of Beor, answered him from Shittim unto Gil Gilgal, that he may know the righteousness of the Lord. We're speaking the truth? Hey, 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 come on, how he came against yeah. us earlier and he was like, man, I first heard you guys and I was like, man, fuck you, man. And, then, and I thought about it, I said, man, them guys are speaking real stuff. I'm a Hebrew, it's like, this sister came up right here, remember yeah, her? Yeah, I was she said, I, like, remember. I said, I used to curse you out. Yeah, I said, I yeah. curse you well, out. But me and my man did research. You guys are speaking the truth. Huh? I'm an uh, Israelite. Yo, you know what she said? What? She said she said, she said she's an Israelite? Yeah! yeah. Oh, <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> she said, well, you know what she said? She said, she said, yo, she said, yo. I said, yo, please, please go on the camera. She's gonna come next week because she's in a rush to do something. She said, man, I apologize to you guys, her and the sister. And yo, man, we're gonna make you guys cupcakes and everything. Yo, man. Yo, yo, I want to know. Yo, the Lord is bad, yo. Yo, the Lord is bad, man. You can't say this thing true. Yo. You remember we were slicing she was a missionary? Yeah, yeah. yeah. She said she was yeah. Arabic. Yeah, she said she was uh, Egyptian. Egyptian. Yeah. yeah. And that's yeah, like yeah, me. And the fucking devils, they took down the videos too, And man. her man, is, his name is John. He said she was a, he was a Levite. She said she was Yeah, she said, yo, we start doing research. And yo, what you saying is true. And she started asking about leprosy. God. And I said, Esau was born like that. Mm -hmm. And we, he said, where did they come from? Jacob and Esau. Mm -hmm. They're actually our biological brothers and sisters, but they're the evil negative ones. God. And she was like, oh, man, that makes so much sense. And she said, yo, I'm an Israelite. I'm so sorry. He hugged me. I'm so sorry. Oh. He said, I'm going to make you guys cupcakes. I promise. She's going to testimony low on the next and, week. And you see, she was going to do it right now. See how she, she looked, though. Yo, because, man. Like, I, I through the different. spirit believe, like, cause I remember when she walked down the street, I was like, yo, she got demons on her. Yeah. And ever yeah, since right. that, she used to pass by, she got skinnier and skinnier. Uh -huh. She was smoking, yeah. she was looking like defiled. Oh, the Lord jacked her up, man, because yeah. of that, man. She and now be she the... came back and said that what? That you guys are speaking the truth. That's repentance and, right and there. She, it's repentance. And, and she, she called the cops. She yeah, called yeah, the cops yeah, on us. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah. teaching hate. Uh -huh. Right here, she's like, you're teaching hate. And she came and apologized. Hey, so you're, gonna me, have, um, you're gonna have people. Uh, that's uh, why you gotta watch out putting curses man. on people. We was mad at her. God, yeah. God. We got, and then she said, fuck you guys, you're full of shit. Now look, she came and said, oh, you guys, you're gonna have people like that. That, they come out, that came against us and they're gonna come back and embrace us through the spirit. God, that's God. powerful. She's she gonna come. I tried to get her on camera, but she said next week. I said, please, man, if you can do that, that's powerful. She's gonna come God. next week and do a testimony. God. Hey, man. <laughs> See, and that's how you know, man, this is the truth, man. That's oh, how you, that's and that's how you know we're at the oh, end, too. And that's how you know, Yo, people, the doors of repentance are still open, man. Give me that street. also, Isaiah 55. Read that. Ezekiel chapter 33, verse 33. And when this cometh to pass, lo, it will come. Then shall they, then shall they know that a prophet hath been among them. That's right, man. She, she knew that a prophet was among her right now, man. It took, hey, it, it took her whatever struggles, whatever she went through, but obviously, that conversation was so profound to her that she had to actually go and do research. She said that she was like over research. a year ago, man. That was over and a year ago. she knew the scripture she was calling Yeah, 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 because she was a missionary. Yeah, she's a missionary. She was, and, and well, you can say we're doing something. That was when I was prophesying too. She came to school when I was prophesying yeah. uh, in Spanish. She was telling me in Spanish, oh, you're wrong. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you need to uh, uh, get away from this cult and all of that. 
This was brother. This was in, uh, I believe it was like the end of July or August. It was around when Padak came in 2015, so it's almost two years ago. Come on, yeah, almost two years ago. Yeah, man. And when she came, she was thicker. Yeah, yeah, she was The Lord jacked her up to the point where he humbled her. Maybe now, the Lord, the Lord dissed on her. And she's so scared now, like, yo, I gotta get myself right. She even said she's gonna bake us cakes. Yeah. got different continents on Yeah, she do got different continents. Hey, man. The Lord is bad, man. Hey, that's powerful, man. Damn, that's that's speechless right there. Yeah. Man. And, and that's what's going to, you know, that's how you know that power, man. That we about to really start getting that power too. Cause that time of, of people on the, that was scoffing, they you have a scoffers that's gonna repent, man. Right. Hey, you scoffers, y'all still can repent. Yeah. yeah. Get that scripture. Yeah, 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 yeah. Even her girlfriend said that you said that she's gonna be a concubine. Kind of, let me get this one first. Hey, because we was oh, cursing first. her out, but well, this is not that proves that it's not our movie. That's right. And one that's thing we right. say when they hey, man, you gone. Huh? And then look, she came back. So we mm -hmm. this is not our movie, man. We're just that's vessels. Right. Hey, and that's why you know, how you said before, that's why you gotta watch out you put curses on, man. Yeah, you can't put curses you on people. You can't be putting curses on people because those might be the elect, man. Hey, I remember the brother uh, Tazaya when I said it, you know, from DTA, he was like, everybody got a spiritual birthday, you know? That seed has to be planted. The scripture says that the Lord gave uh, Paul, uh, Paul planted Apollo's uh, uh, water, but the Lord gives the increase. She got planted, you know, back then. We thought, you know, the, 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 our thoughts and not his thoughts. We thought she was destined for death, but there it go, man. She repented and said that we got the truth, man, which is not us. It's the Lord, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai. Right. He has the truth, man. And you know what's crazy? The brothers got the more spiritual. They God. think on the carnal. Most I gonna kill you, but when you think in this, in the spirit, oh, she got demons on her. Right. That's, that's why. Yo. That's why the spirit of the Lord, the spirit Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, be casting out demons off people through the name. The spirit of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, just cast off this demon. They even showed an exorcist. That the spirit of Christ compels you. The spirit of Christ compels. And then the Linda Blair was like, and that demon came out of her. So we're more healers. When you read about the acts of Yahweh Shai, he was healing. He didn't kill nobody 2,000 years ago. Because when you're healing, you're actually killing those demons. You're, 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 you're exercising those demons. So when you say, you spirit by Yahweh and believe in it and casting out that demon, you got to think spiritually, man. God. You can't be thinking, Connor, all oh, this bitch. Well, we don't know. Right. The most I might let her get this word, which she did, and she got jacked up God. to the point where she came back and hugged us. God. And so you guys got the truth. Yeah. Oh, she, man, that's man. That's man. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that? God. This is Isaiah 55 and 6. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. That's right, man. You gotta seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Hey, on that video too of her, that video went viral it too. Did. Man. Come on, come on. That was that was a viral video of her, and he had a lot of scoffers on there talking about, oh, she she was cutting them, she was cutting them with the scriptures. She was right and they was wrong. Yeah. Now what you gonna say? Now what you gonna say? Yeah. Yeah. She know what I said. We was right and she was wrong. <laughs> and they knew what we told them. We laughed. Yes, they laughed right away. I said we don't care. We know a lot of guys. You pretty. So we know yeah, a lot yeah, of guys yeah. will buy out you, but we not gonna buy yep. out. So I went. Yep. We told you the truth, <laughs> and she was busting out laughing. Like she respected that. God, you know why God. we did that? Because we love you. That's right. right. That's why we tell you the truth. And right. she was like, yo, man, I really love y'all. I said, man, that's beautiful, man. God, remember, like, little by little, she would walk by and not say nothing. Uh -huh. and little by little, she would walk and, like, she would wave. She would do a little wave, and she would do, she would do a smile. Yeah. And then now she finally said it, man. Hey, that's how you know, man, that the, this is the Lord's deny movie. the truth. You can't. Man, it's powerful. You can't, God. man. Yeah. The truth the, the truth trumps everything, man. That's set you free. Uh, right. so I, I got uh, I just say this too, I'm gonna put it script right quick. You also gotta keep in mind those that didn't receive the true Holy Spirit of Yahweh Shai to understand, you know, his capacity and what he was created for. Because keep in mind, the people that heard about him, the rumor was that he was doing those works in the name of the devil, Beelzebub. Until during the time of the um, Pentecost, first uh, feast of first fruits, when the spirit, spiritual power of tongues speaking in different languages came, a lot of those people recognized, like, oh wow, that was the Messiah. Wow, that was the Lord. These are his disciples. These are his apostles. And the multitude of them that went against them actually repented and was converted. Because keep in mind, when Yahweh Shah was on the cross, he had said, yeah, I said, uh, Father, forgive them, you know not what they do. Basically, lay not the sin upon their charge, because you had some of the um, some of the elect. Okay, keep in mind, some of the chosen, they actually went against the Lord's chosen. They went against the Messiah, and the Lord prayed for them. Even uh, Stephen, Stephen had prayed for them. Also, you know, and, uh, and just to show you, Apostle um, Paul, when he was Saul, he was also in that um, category as well. 
Hey, yeah, kind of said that. What? Um, he winked at our ignorance. I don't know if he said that, but he said that in a time of your uh, time of your ignorance, he winked at it. You know, but now it's time for everybody. You know, once you hear this word, you either got to repent. That's why it says. That's why how should I said that. That now, since I came, there should be no cloak for my, for your sins. So, hey, man, it's still like I said, man. It's still it's still the doors of repentance are still open, man. People can still repent from from their iniquity, from their scoffing, from their backbiting. Hey, from from them from them going off, from them doing wickedness. The Lord, the Lord is merciful, man. He said, he he he. Ah, uh, give me that in uh, uh Sirach, the 18th chapter. Get that. Yeah, so, uh, I got a couple pieces. Con. It's uh Second Peter chapter three verse nine. That's the gospel too, man. Yep. That's right. That's the, that made us that made us happy. Con. Even though she came at us and she was uh you know vexing us, that. yeah, we just forgot about it just like that. And that's and that's why the scripture says that the angels in heaven rejoices over one over one that repenteth, man. Right. Right. It's, uh Second Peter chapter three verse nine. The Lord is not slack concerning His promise, as some men count slackness, but is long suffering to us word. Not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. There you go. The Lord is 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 not slack on His promise of us getting the kingdom, because that kingdom is coming, all right. And it says what? But He's long suffering, yeah. man. He's suffering long, longly for for the elect's sake, man. Yeah. You know, it might get us vexed that we you know, because we know the truth. So they, like, oh, why? Why is it not heavy enough? But you still got other elect that's out there, man. You still got other sheep that's out there. That's right. The Lord said what? If um, there was 99 sheep and one was lost, will He not? leave the 99 and go get the one that's lost that's how that's the type of shepherd that you got to have the type of mentality that you got to have in your mind of how to be um that kind of shepherd man it's the lord is gathering a whole elect man so it, it makes us you know it makes us happy when we see even scoffers repent man that's how you know that's the power of the how about shot you want to say something i was gonna say and as a shepherd you want to be the shepherd that when the sheep see you they come to you not the shepherd that you scared them off. Con. And like, we're not supposed to be out here, you know, we come in the spirit of Yahweh Shai. We're not out here to just condemn, condemn people because think about it, what's, what's Yahweh Shai's name? He deliverer, he's a savior. Not he the killer, he the condemner. Okay? Con. Hey, scripture say he destroyed the Gentiles. He's going to destroy two thirds of Israel because they're in a Gentile state of mind. Con. But, you know, it said that we uh, we basically, you said something today. You said you had a, uh, 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 we didn't come out here to condemn. But the scriptures does say that through the fear of the Lord, we persuade men. Con. So, we're telling you out of fear, all right, of the Lord that if you don't repent, you're gonna get destroyed. That should that should that should put ignite some fear in you. You know, not everybody gets gets uh, woken up by off a of nice words. Some gotta get woken up by off a of hear that if you don't repent, you're gonna die. You know, that's a balance to everything, man. But uh, I got two. Con, con, get that one first. All right. This is Acts chapter two, verse thirty-six. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know assuredly that God hath made the same Yahweh whom he has crucified. So this is Paul. Uh, to lie. This is Peter speaking to the Israelites after Yahweh you know, uh, was crucified and raised up. He's telling them. Uh, Read it again from top. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know assuredly that God hath made the same. Jesus, Yahweh, whom ye have crucified, both Lord and Christ, Mashiach. There you, there you go, he said, both whom ye have crucified. Because even though the Romans physically carried out the crucifixion of Yahweh, our people, Israel, was the ones that got him crucified. So here it is, Peter is talking to the same people that a couple days or a couple weeks or a couple months, never probably like a couple months prior, was was the one that got Yahweh Shai uh, crucified, man. He still went to those people that, that got the Lord crucified and said what? Uh, no, you can keep going here. Actually, yeah. Now, when they had when they heard this, they were pricked in their heart and said unto Peter and the rest of the apostles, men and brethren, what shall we do? There you go. It said they was pricked in their heart. Why? Because they were sorrowful, man. The scripture talks about being sorrowful unto repentance. She, that woman, she was sorrowful unto repentance. And she repented and she uh, she acknowledged that these words of the of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh which we were speaking, was is the truth. And, and she got pricked. And just like how those men got pricked, even though some of those men right there, Back then, you know, whenever they, whenever Yahweh saw how far, you know, the, the, the time intervention was, they at that moment they were ignorant to what they were doing. But when when they heard these words, they realized that they, they fucked up. So they asked him, "What shall we do to be saved?" Go ahead. Then Peter said unto them, "Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Yahweh Shai Mashiach." for the remission of sins, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. So he told them to repent and be saved, every one of you. 
So that's the same message that we're coming out here saying, man. Is to repent so that you can that you can receive the Holy Spirit, which is gonna give you that substance in, in order for you to to endure until the end. Because without the Holy Spirit, you're not gonna be able to endure to the end. Hey, hey man, that's 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 the testament to the power of the Lord, man. That's a testament to the truth too. You got something, you say you got something else or this more? Yeah, there's more in this, I got something else. I got something else in the pocket. Uh, Acts chapter 2, verse 39. For the promise is unto you and to your children. Hey, we were talking about that earlier. About the about Yahweh Shai. The promise, the promise is unto you. The promise is unto the, the children of Israel, man. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. This isn't your rest, man. This isn't your this isn't your kingdom. This is this kingdom was promised to who? To Esau. And see what he did with it, man. This place is going down. This place is, it, 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 it took, what, Esau 200 plus years to build uh United States? Well, to have us build the United States? And Laura is crumbling, is, is crumbling it even quicker, man. The days are being short, all right? Which means that you either going to get destroyed here or you want to you wanna seek for the, for the kingdom to come, the continuing city, man. Because this isn't our continuing city. Go ahead. For the promise is unto you and to your children and to all that are far off, even as many as the Lord our, our God shall call. The promise is unto our children and us, man. The promise of the kingdom of heaven, of peace, of everlasting rulership, everlasting of everlasting uh, 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 life to, for the uh, for the uh, uh, like, man. This is what this is what we're seeking for, man. Not trying to live it up here. Not trying to uh, have have a nice. Nice job in, in a big house and uh, a, a, a nice life here, man. This is all vanity. The scripture says that the fashion of this world passes away, man. We see that this world is, is going down, man. This age is going down. You got Simba, we were just talking about him last week. <laughs> we were just talking about how Lion King was is spiritual and now they're making a fucking a, a remake and they're making Simba gay, man. When we was and we had mentioned how you know Simba represents Israel. Yo, you devils, man. <laughs> you devils. Yeah. You guys, even man. Even the first one has subliminal gay shit. Yeah. Like the part that he fell on the floor and, 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 and that, that dust went up in the air. They broke it down. It says sex. Oh, uh, there's a lot of. Yeah, there's, a lot of um, there's a lot of what they call it uh, uh, sexism. Yeah. Sex in, in Disney all the time, man. Yeah. yeah, a lot of a lot of child uh, pornography and all that stuff, man. Sexual but sex in your windows. Sex in your windows, but. But to make Simba gay, yo, you devils, Simba man. Gay. You know what? But it's Disney. Walt Disney. He was one of the elites anyway, so yeah, yeah, I'm not exactly. fucking surprised, man. We, we, ain't, we, ain't, we ain't surprised by you devils, you devil schemes, man. That just lets you know that how how quickly you're falling down. Because you're not even you're not even trying to hide shit anymore. Honestly, man, the only way Esau can surprise me is if he started pushing the law of statutes and commandments. That's the only way Esau could do something that was shocking. Like, oh shit, he said don't commit adultery? What the fuck? He said don't steal? He he's, 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 I can't. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, he's not, not gonna, gonna do happen. that. Yeah. So I'm not gonna be surprised. That's like, right. <laughs> but you got these people out here that, oh, it's okay to have, you know, gay, gay uh, 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 people in in the Disney Channel. Yeah. You had a gay Power Rangers. You had somebody gay in the Beauty and the Beast that they just came out with. Now you have oh, a, a, gay and lesbian in the Power Power Rangers. Power Ranger Con. So okay. you know. Hey, the scripture says, man, that the, the, the time is going to wax worse and worse, man. The love of many shall wax worse and worse. Everything is going to just get worse and worse. That's why the spirit on the right hand side is going to combat it. We got more people waking up. We got more people. Then we have certain men get that uh, that spiritual power, man. Because Esau is, is working on the uh, Satan's busy on the left hand side, man. So the Lord is not going to just let the right hand side be dull and docile. He's going to raise up his men to get that spiritual power to combat that, man. Oh, oh shit. God, yeah, you got fucking dildos, man. That's wild. I got a scripture for you. Going to everything you were saying. Con. This is uh, 2 Ezra chapter 16. We start at 25. It says, Whosoever remaineth from all these things that I have told thee shall escape and see my salvation and the end of your world. There you go. Whosoever shall remain. That's what it's about. It's about pushing and remaining in the states. Just man falls seven times, but he gets back up. But he says, what day? Who shall ever remain and do what? Whoever, whosoever remaineth from all these things that I have told thee shall escape and see my salvation and the end of your world. There you go, and the end of your world. Who world? <laughs> your, your world. And they understand that the end of their world is, is nine, man. That's why they pushing out.